I think Scottish cinema is extraordinary, absolutely extraordinary. I think, I think Peter Mullen is one of the truly, truly great talents of the Scottish cinema. I think he's uh, astonishing. The work he's doing is, I mean, in the, every film he does, it's, has that extra edge to it, that sort of power of the imagination, and it's not always r rooted in this kind of naturalism. It has, it, it elevates itself. No, I, I do think there's a, there's enormous possibilities for us here. Um, certainly in making films, but not just making Scottish films, but actually f as an industry, I think we've got a lot of talent here, and I think with the right, you know, the right tax breaks and stuff like that, we could do the most extraordinary things. But as as in terms of our writers and in terms of our filmmaker Lynn Ramsey, the, the the potential is enormous. But the thing that Scots filmmakers must not do is they mustn't do poor me. <laughs> you know, they mustn't fall into the trap of poor me. And there's a tendency to do that. There's a tendency to be a little bit, for a lot of young Scottish filmmakers, Scottish actors, Scottish everybody, artists, oh, I'm only just that wee boy from, or I'm just that wee lassie from, or oh, I am. I, it's what I call the Wayne's world thing. <laughs> I am not worthy, I am not worthy, you know. And that is something that, it's a mindset that's really got to shift big time, especially in the wake of what's going to happen over the next two or three years in Scotland in terms of where we stand independently or not independently. But we have to move. And that's an old mindset that's been hanging over us for years and years and years, and it's got to shift big time.